Well, meantime, President Biden meeting with the nation's top four congressional leaders today to discuss passing aid packages and government funding. Meeting with House Speaker Mike Johnson, Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer, House Minority Leader Hakeem Jeffries, and Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell. The president will discuss the importance of passing this aid package, which includes support for both Ukraine and Israel, as well as funding to avoid a partial government shutdown. News Nation's Kelly Meyer joins us live from Washington there. Kelly, at this point, how far apart are lawmakers on any type of agreement here? Well, it's a lot of finger pointing on both sides here, Nicole, but this is a big moment to get these big four leaders here at the same time in the same room. It's actually something that House Speaker Mike Johnson has been requesting a one on one meeting with President Biden over the crisis at the border. Now those two are in the same room, along with Mitch McConnell, Chuck Schumer, as well as Hakeem Jeffries. We just heard from President Biden uh, starting this meeting off the top there, thanking them for coming here. They are currently in this meeting right now. They talked about uh, addressing, of course, course, this potential shutdown. They talked as well about funding for Ukraine as well as for Israel. So all of these things on the table. But first, where they're going to start with first on the agenda is this partial government shutdown that could come this Friday, impacting four areas, agriculture, energy, military construction, veteran affairs and transportation. We just checked in with the Department of Veteran Affairs. They said that there would be no impact here on veteran health care or like burials at the, the VA cemeteries. But they said that they wouldn't be able to do VA outreach. And that comes as millions of new veterans exposed to toxic burn pits are now eligible for health care. Now, of the four leaders here today, the top two in the Senate, Schumer and McConnell, seem eye to eye here on averting a shutdown. It's the pressure building on the House Speaker here, whether he'll move this to the floor and get Democratic support like his predecessor did, and that cost him his job. Let's take a listen to this. We realize the Speaker of the House is in a difficult position, but he must reject the MAGA hard right, which wants a shutdown, wants to hurt America, and which does not represent a majority of Republicans in the House. That was Senator Schumer there just this morning, also likely to come up, as we said, the crisis at the border. The bipartisan border deal remains stalled. House Speaker uh, Johnson also saying that Ukraine, Israel, Taiwan aid not being brought up for a vote there in the House. Speaker Johnson, as we said, has been requesting a one on one meeting with President Biden for the last month or so now. Biden had said he was happy to meet with Johnson, quote, if he has something to say. Now, News Nation is learning that Biden isn't expected to bring up any kind of executive orders uh, or executive action action on the border when he goes there later this week, the same day as former President Donald Trump. So these four may be wrapping up their meeting here any minute. We're keeping an eye out as there is a position here for those leaders to potentially come and talk to the press following that. So we'll, we will keep you up to date if that happens. Nicole. Yeah, we'll certainly uh, be anxiously waiting. Kelly, thank you. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.